Hello everyone, this is Kinzun here. Welcome back to my LP of Pokemon Heart Gold. For the DS. Of course it's for the DS. Anyway, in the last episode we uh, proceeded through this route of 27 and the Tojo Falls. And to this route of Route 26. And in, the, in this episode we're going to continue going through this way. I don't know why there's a slash out. Sand slash here. That's kind of weird. And out of place. Anyway, let's go down to this house over here before I forget. Anyway. Let's go down to this house of... <gasps> anyway, like I was saying, let's go down to this house over here. And you can read something here with along with like seven beds. Yes, read it. To my brothers and sisters, we take pride in serving Pokemon trainers. When trainers talk to you, give them something useful. Love, Monica. Keep reading? Yes. And right here is the, the day siblings where you'll find Monica Monday on Route 40 on Monday and then the, and vice versa of everywhere else in this region. Oh, one's a black one? Wait, what is it today? Today's Friday. Thank you, Ari. Um, you're at the Frida Friday one. That's the Poison Barb, right? Let me check. Yeah, I have it already. Okay, let's make it sure. We can go down, go down this way. Oh, there's nothing that way. Little trap was tripping me up. Anyway, let's keep going down this way. And this is a not really a secret route, but just uh, some place that you could get out of and for that route. Also, what? Wait, no. This is actually a good thing because I remember seeing something down here. I believe. Let me see if I can go to it really quick. I run to a random encounter. Okay, now that that's over. There's a little section of land down here. Let me see if there's anything around here. No, wrong thing. Oh, above me. A nugget. Nice. I knew there was something down here. I mean, it's a little too suspicious to, you know, be empty. I think there's something else over on the other side. Let me check. Or not. Okay, let's just proceed. <sighs> okay, got that over with. Let's just... Go this. There you go. This way. See if there's anything in these rocks. Just, just curious. Oh, there was something in one of the rocks. A big mushroom, which I can sell. Yay. Anyway, let's go this way. To Route 26. God dang it. Luckily, it's a fisherman, and I could just zap it to death. Or his Pokemon, not him. Anyway, got that battle over with. This is guy is a photographer. Let me see. If, let me get my Pokemon in order here. Wait, no, never mind. Kane's not in the party. Dang it. <laughs> I wanted to take a picture of my Pokemon, but Kane's not here, so. I will <sighs> okay, now I got that over with. Good lord. Uh, let's see. Where am I going to next? Uh, I actually got burned in that battle because of the Ponyta. So let me go in here and heal for a second. Because I don't want to waste an item that I could use in the Pokemon battle in the future. I don't know about that, but whatever. Let's just keep going this way. Yeah. Avoid this trainer. She's just going to go in that kind of direction. Aha! I believe there's nothing up here. Because it's just a ledge that you can hop down if you so choose. Oh, well, I'm going to have to face this guy. There's no... To it. it sends her buzz about it. Yes, I know. I guess this is a uh, acquired one. I won't cut it out. Gavin. Victory Bell. Okay. I like Victory Bell to be honest. Not the way it looks, but just the stats. And not so much as move sets, because move sets kind of suck. But it has good stats, so that's something. Use TMs and HMs on this guy. Well, not HMs. That would be sucky. This TMs would be fine. I actually used one in an older playthrough of this game. He had served me very well if, when I gave him TMs. <laughs> These moves are awful. Anyway, get this over with. And Squad grew to level 39. He's going to grow to level 40 eventually and be my first 40 Pokemon. <laughs> Sounds kind of weird. Oh, I should have picked um, Gwenna. I said Garnet. I've been going to Garnet too much. To be honest. Kingler. Okay. Trying to punch you in the face. Let's 
Sorry, I'm just adjusting my feet here. I actually have my shoes on for some reason. I guess because I took my dogs out a while ago and I just hadn't taken them off yet. 39. Flareon. <laughs> I don't have any. Oh man. Oh well. I was about to say, I don't have any water types, but yes, I do. <laughs> now, why does he have Flareon? That's stupid. I don't like Flareon. It's the weakest evolution besides Glaceon. It's, except I actually like the look of Glaceon, so it's fine. For me. Anyway. Get this over with. Surf! At least it's lower 32 and not like 40 or something. But it didn't beat it. Of course it didn't. His accuracy fell. Luckily Surf has 100% accuracy, so it's just like 95 that went down. Critical hit. Very nice. Very nice, Demol. Feed him! Feed him more Pokemon. Okay. Enough of that. No. 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 Nope. More required battles, seriously? Is there anything over here? Oh, there is. A tiny mushroom. Sure, why not? Didn't use a stylus for that. I used my fingernail, which is very long right now. You know what? I'm gonna put Quinn up in front. Why not? She needs some experience. He, she, it. I don't know. It's clearly a she in the game, but not in the not Final Fantasy IX. Anyway. Make a final preparations for the Pokemon League. Probably, this isn't the last trainer we fight before we go to Victory Road. Jake. Parasite. I chose poorly. <laughs> but oh well, Quinn and I see experience. So, sure, why not? Ghost Wall. Spore! You cheap bastard. <laughs> That's a 100% sweet move. So, yeah. That was poor timing. Only Paris and Parasite can learn that. And I believe um, um, any kind of mushroom Pokemon can learn it, like. Reloom event actually in the future, or the the um, uh, the one in the fifth gen I forget its name. Amoongus, Amoong fungus. I don't know. I know I can see the Pokemon in my head. I just can't remember the, the actual name for it. Also, would you just wake up? But yeah, only like three Pokemon lines can actually learn Spore. And if you have, like, a, um, Pokemon, like, what's his name? Smeargle? And also, what? Are you serious? Okay, now you're just gonna die. Even though it's a bug type, I don't care. You're going to die by Psybeam, because you need to learn. Confu- or Psychic, eventually. Oh, come on. Of course it goes for Leech Life, which sucks. For it and for me. It's not that strong, so it's okay. <laughs> God, that was stupid. I died to Chris. A stupid slash. I hate you, Parasite. I can't believe Squall lost a Parasite. That's just stupid. Anyway. Now we can use Quinna for something. Or Kina. Some people pronounce it Kina with, with Q U. Kind of like quiet or when uh, never mind. <laughs> never mind. Uh, Vine Whip. You're a physical attacker, aren't you? Just a little bit. He's more of a defensive tank than anything. Physical one. And I hit my mic. I'm sorry about that. I just keep rocking back and forth. I don't know if you can hear that or not in the mic. But whatever. I just have that habit of rocking back and forth. I'm sure you can hear it in my videos sometimes. Because chords. Anyway. Why are you not dead? Isn't it isn't it Quinn a defensive tank as well? Just not the fire. Because obviously it'll burn it to cool, to a crisp. Ah, whatever. What? Are you serious? It's just hanging on by one HP. <sighs> I should use like stun spore or something. Oh. 
And put my phone went off. I actually have my phone back with my proper ringtones and stuff. Because, um, for the longest time since about the beginning of September, my mom has been having my phone. Because she dropped hers and she hasn't replaced it until like a few days ago. So, <laughs> yeah. Knock off. What's that do again? It, I believe it knocks off an item. And it's like, no, why would I do that? Well, the, the knocking off the item is a good thing, but no, not. Yes, give up. That sounds like a good competitive move, but not really for like a single player. Well that Nope. Another water type. That's not psychic, by the way. I could drink. Because I need How the hell? Oh. I'm not part poison, so that's actually good. Why'd you miss? <sighs> this fight is annoying. And again, I shouldn't be complaining. My Pokemon pretty underleveled. And I need to actually grind a little bit off screen before I get to the Pokemon League. Or face it, I mean. Okay, you stop that. Of course everything's faster than me. Because my Pokemon are kinda slow. I got all the slow Pokemon that hit hard. Or take a hit. Whatever. I notice that's a trend in my LP in, the, in this LP. See, it's like I got the Pokemon that are the slowest. <laughs> or some of them at least. Like Garnet, Quinn, uh, maybe Squall, I'm not sure. Why do you keep missing? <sighs> this fight's annoying. I should use Vine Whip. Because Mega Drain apparently is not doing wonders for me. <sighs> I hate these required fights. Fine whip. Because usually I have nothing to talk about. That's why I usually cut them out of the unrequired ones. Unless there's actually something I need to talk about. Because, you know, that's the thing. How long has this battle been taking me? I don't know. Get out of here, Jake. Go play with Finn or something. Uh, I've got to face that trainer too. Oh. Is it? No, let's not use a hyper potion. Let's use one of you and one of you. Wait, no, wait. What am I? What am I doing? There's a healing spot. Well, actually, I got there's a trainer if I do it wrong. Ah, whatever. I can always revive the items again. I don't like more revives, but when I get to the Pokemon League, that'll be fine. I'll be fine. Wait, no. More heals. Sure. No, why not? Okay. This girl has a rapid dash, I believe. I don't know why I know that, but whatever. Let's actually use. Sure, why not? See more. See more rapid dashes. Yeah, that pun's never gonna get old. I lost to a red-headed trainer. He was really strong, but it was as if he had absolutely had to win at any cost. I felt sorry for his Pokemon. And why are you still out here? Did you go back to that lady in the house before going back to that spot? Hey, I knew it. She had a Rapidash. Hooray for my memory. Which is usually quite crappy, but whatever. Those kind of things. Anyway, surf. I could use Waterfall and it'll probably do a little bit more damage because Gyarados is a physical attacker. And since the physical special split in this gen happened, it'd probably be a good idea. I'll wait and see on the, the next Pokemon if it's not like an Electro type. I forget. Just start critting me, please. And just die. Thank you. Alright, that's a good chunk of experience. Blaffy. I knew it was... How did I guess that? <laughs> and I usually have no types for, like, electric counterparts. Except for Squall, because he knows Dig. This is nice. This is nice. It's a nice tactic for, like, ground types, because I, I don't really have, like, a type of Pokemon that 
can be resistant to electric types. Like ground. But no, I don't have one. I could, but no. I don't want it. At least Squawk can learn Jake. That's nice. And it did the job. Except I got static. That's why I picked Ampharos and Flappy and Marie. And also he got very lucky with that <laughs> experience. Okay. No. 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 Stop it. Maybe later. Because I'm actually going to go back and heal. I'm going to go to my menu so I don't have to talk to my mom. Yeah, there we go. Oh, there's actually an item over here. What? A max elixir. That's nice. That'd be useful for the Pokemon League. Anything there? No. Just making sure. Eh. Aha! There we go. That feels so much better. Let me go heal up again and. stuff. And not face that trainer again. Hopefully. I'll probably face her off screen or something, because right now you can avoid her, so yeah. I also got that app point off screen before I started the recording. Aha. Gotcha. Anyway, let's go over here and get through the reception gate, which is apparently a part of the region, but no, it's not really. All the trash have proven. The eight badges of Johto. Why would there be a reception here anyway? I guess so they could have like guards to block these pass off, which is that's the Kanto and this or the major part of Kanto. And this is just Mount Silver. So yeah. Oh wait, no, I didn't mean to go in here. Get out of here. I don't really need that in my video yet. Whoops. Anyway, I think I'm gonna stop it here for now because it's been twenty two minutes and stuff. So yeah, in the next episode of Pokemon Heart Gold, we will go through Victory Road, which has no trainers except for one. Anyway, I'll see you guys next time. Let's play Pokemon Heart Gold. Bye for now. What do you think? Of course, he's not used to me. I don't ever use them. Anyway, bye for now.